Hello guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new. My name is Claire and I live in Birmingham, Alabama and today is a very exciting day because I have not filmed a vlog like this in literally probably closer to two years and maybe at the least like a year, maybe probably more like a year and a half. Up today I was just so excited because today I am going to be vlogging my whole day and it is going to be like a fall vlog and when I say I'm going to be vlogging my day, this will be like the first vlog that I have not had somebody else in, especially like on a weekend, like today's Saturday. Um, and this is just gonna be all me, a superstar show. It's currently September the 9th, it's football season. It's almost officially fall. It's starting to slowly feel like fall outside. I'm so excited, I got this long sleeve t-shirt in the men's section at Target last night for only $9. Um, go get you one. But I was so excited today because I have not got to like really take my camera around Birmingham, just kind of do my own thing in so long. And it is the first Saturday where everybody else has plans today except for me. Tyler, who's my boyfriend, um, he is at the Alabama-Texas game today. His friend got him an extra ticket and then my friends were busy. So I was like, you know what? I could go find something to do. Like I could go tag along to one of their events or something, but like I didn't have a ticket to the game. And then I was just really thinking about it and I have not had a Claire day in so long and I asked myself what would the old Claire do like old Claire from like two years ago like before I met Tyler like a week before I met him I literally had nothing to do on a Saturday so I drove to New Orleans by myself for the day that is the kind of person I was like I typically like honestly if I was feeling it I would probably like old Claire would have driven from Birmingham to like Nashville or Atlanta today but we're gonna stay local we are going to just stay here we're gonna go shopping and we're gonna decorate for fall we're gonna give it all the fall things and I'm having like like a late start to the day I've um, actually been awake since 7 this morning and me and Tyler woke up we ran three miles <laughs> I haven't done that in a minute honestly and after we ran um ooh. I'm actually gonna use this new All Over Glow Enhancer from Fenty Beauty. This was in my FabFitFun box. My fall FabFitFun box was everything to me. I got these little hoop earrings right here and I have not taken them out <laughs> since I opened the box. And then this was in there too. I think this is how you apply this stuff. Oh, and also my the Summer Fridays Vanilla Beige Lip Balm is in there. And you can use my code, um, D 20 I believe, to get 20% off your first box. This is not sponsored. This is just like I genuinely would do this or I would buy this for somebody. And you can get your first box for under $50, which includes all of those things I just showed and also more. And today we are just going to decorate for fall and then I have a bunch of stuff that I just need to get from the store, like from Target. I wanna go to Home Goods. I wanna go to TJ Maxx probably and like look at their fall stuff. So like I said, I woke up at 7 a.m., went on a run and then Tyler and his friend left at like 10.30. So between like seven and 10, I ran. We cleaned up the house a little bit, or the apartment a little bit, did some laundry and then I took a shower and then I, Tyler left at like 10.30 and then it was like 11 and I was about to sit down and do my makeup and like go take on the day. But I ate some lunch, some leftover pizza. And then after that I was like so full and I was like, let me just sit down for a second. I fell asleep, so it is currently 1.32. I took like an hour long nap, and then I've kind of just been like scrolling on my phone, and I was like, you know what? I'm not in a rush for anybody today. Like today, Tyler's gonna be back probably like at midnight. I have nobody to entertain all day long, and so I miss him, and it's so weird because like I never thought I'd be the type of girl to like really miss my boyfriend, you know what I mean? But like I find myself missing him like needing him to like open jars and stuff those are things that old claire would have been like girl but i love him so much but it's also good to have your own little self-care time you know and one reason like i really love tyler is i haven't had to stop doing any of the things that i love in the last two years i've just kind of like adapted what i do to like include him in it and that's what makes like our relationship is so fun like that because it's the same for him like I don't know, we all we still do all of our favorite things like shopping, going to the gym, cooking, all that stuff. But sometimes it is good to like just be like a solo independent woman for the day. So that's what we're gonna do. It's gonna be all the girly fall vibes. I was gonna go get my nails done today, right? Um like a nice fall color, but I don't know if I'm gonna do that anymore because yesterday I actually blew a hole in my tire. I ran over something very sharp and a gigantic hole was in my tire, like profusely blowing air out. It was a very chaotic day. You can hear all about it on our podcast on the episode that comes out on September 11th. It ended up being a lot of money, so I think I'm not going to get my nails done today, but we are going to go get some things that I have on my list and I want to make it cute in here. I just, 
you know, I have a vision. Finished my makeup, and I just have to say, this NARS foundation, the um, NARS Radiant Longwear Foundation, I have been obsessed with it. It literally puts like a filter on your skin. Like my makeup has looked so smooth since I started wearing this foundation. So 10 out of 10 recommend. Um, if I remember, I will link it down below. I'm in the shade Val Valaris. Um, and that's with self tanner. I honestly need to get another regular high end foundation for when I'm not using self tanner. Ignore my hands. Um, but while I was doing my makeup, I was watching Remy Ashton's vlog of her getting proposed and I started tearing up. Like, I just love love. Oh, also, I got a haircut yesterday. You can't really tell here fully, but I did get like kind of curtain bangs. Um, and then she layered the whole backside of my head because my hair is so long. I got no length taken off, but I was like, my hair is so heavy. Like it weighs like seven pounds. Now it feels like it weighs a solid four. And like, I know y'all have seen the living room, like if you've been on my channel before, but we just put in my old pink rug and Loki is like a vibe. This couch is massive and it definitely won't be coming with us where we go next. Neither will like these pillows that are mine, like the girly pillows. And the rug I may sell unless like I have my own room. Um, but yeah, so we're working with some stuff. And another thing we want to do is like get some prints of some photos of like me and Tyler because we don't really have like any pictures. Like these are so first of all, this uh, apartment was Tyler and his brothers before I moved in, and so we have like like that's gonna go. We've been meaning to take that down. It's more like their stuff. But, and then like this over here, I don't love any of this. Like it's very cluttered and stuff, but this is like probably how it's gonna stay for the most part until we move. But I just want some like things to jazz this place up, make it feel like fall, make it feel homey. But honestly, this rug really made it feel so much more cozy. Bella loves the rug, don't you Bella? But another thing we have to get is some Bath & Body Works candles. They're doing their $12.95 deal today. These are the only two fall candles I have, which is crazy because I used to have so many. Um, this one is from when I used to work for Victoria's Secret and I got to go to their deal sale thing where you um, go to like the warehouse sale for Victoria's Secret Bath & Body Works, pink, Henry Bindle, all the things. And then this one's from like two years ago. It's pumpkin apple. Okay, so I'm next in line at Starbucks and I'm gonna share with you guys my order. It is the perfect iced fall drink in my opinion. Um, you can get it also with the pumpkin cream cold foam, but this is just... I get so excited to drink it. Also, my water. I need to focus on drinking more water. Like, since ending 75 hard, I've barely been getting in, like, half a gallon. Gotta prioritize that more. It feels like it's really dark in here. I think the screen on my phone is darker than what it actually is, so I'm so sorry if it is. But what you're gonna order is a venti ice latte with an extra shot of espresso. A quad espresso, a quad latte just tastes so much better. And then you get one pump of white mocha and two pumps of pumpkin. You can also order a venti pumpkin spice latte with only two pumps of pumpkin, an extra shot of espresso, no whip. And I don't know if it's cheaper that way. There's like a way where they can like put in the extraness to make it not as expensive because it is an expensive drink but it's acquired so many points because I get breakfast and stuff for me and Tyler a good bit from Starbucks but truth be told I really need to like cut it down to like once a week because pumpkin season's dangerous but you know what's even better Irish cream cold foam Irish cream is my weakness and they have it at like a local coffee shop here and a local coffee shop back home and the things I would do for Irish cream. Like it's it's the best syrup, truly. I've decided to go to Home Goods first. And if you live in Birmingham, I'm on 280 at that Home Goods. And this is like near where I used to live in Birmingham. So I used to come to this parking lot all the time because there's actually one of our gym locations in this parking lot. Um, but I have not been at this Home Goods, honestly, probably, but, but maybe like three times total. Tyler loves going to like TJ Maxx, Burlington, and like I love that he loves going to those places. But a lot of the time, like Home Goods, you know, it's like one of those. So we're off to a good start. even know guys okay I lucky love this pillow can't explain it also really like these just basic i want that so bad but it's 30 dollars okay, also i don't know if i want more like fall stuff or more like halloweeny stuff so much stuff hmm oh she's cute i don't like the way the sherpa feels okay guys so i did not really find anything that i wanted to like go ahead and get in home goods 
Um, we may go to Trustville in a little while. There's a bug in here. I think I'm about to go over to Lowe's. If you don't know, I actually work for Lowe's. I work for their online team um, and I work remotely, but I get an employee discount, obviously. So I think we're gonna go over to Lowe's and get some flowers for our front porch. One thing about us, or actually I may wait and go to Lowe's when we go to the other area. Actually, let's go ahead and drive by Lowe's. Why not? It's on the other side of the parking lot. I'm so lazy. I just don't feel like driving over there. Okay, these are like what I'm wanting, those mums right there. I think we're gonna either come back and just like kind of look around to see. Now we're at Target and this is the 280 Target. It has recently undergone like a bunch of renovations. It's still going. You can see the tents over here, but let's go see. If they have anything, they have the Ulsa in here too, which is lovely. There's like Loki, so many people in Target. It's almost like game time, so I figured it wouldn't be a lot, but I did need some Morphe setting spray, so that's our first, first secured bag. Okay, we officially made it. This Target looks a little bit more picked over than um, the one Tyler and I went to last night, so I think we may hit up another Target today. Um, but that's just off like first impressions. I just have not seen anything yet, but this is more of like the the party decor I guess rather than the actual You know stuff stuff nice stuff. Okay, here we go. Okay. This is more like what we're looking for like actual decor. I Love this color. Okay, let's see okay, For some reason these pillows right here are on sale for 750 So I think I'm about to get a few of these because like these are jungle. These aren't technically like here for fall but there's nothing wrong with them. So I think I'm gonna get a few of these and then add with regular. Okay, all these pillows are pretty cute. Hmm. I like this one. I'm, not, I'm just like not seeing anything that I'm like, I have to have that or I'm gonna scream, you know? Like these are all cute. Oh wait, these are cutie. And they're only ten dollars what gotta get a rug the question is okay we also need like a kitchen rug and we've been needing one for a while but like i want a cheap one i'm gonna get i think this one for the kitchen just to like keep by the stove no that doesn't match so we also have to get some regular stuff like dish detergent scrub daddies if you have not bought a scrub daddy it's actually worth it and they're not that expensive and they're so good and they last so long we be bopping over to all of the stuff that i need need like this kind of stuff and then we're gonna go to the clothes next and then we're gonna go back to the decor okay we need new hand soap for the kitchen and this literally smells like actual heaven it smells like almond flavoring it smells so good and i'm also in deep need for a new razor or at least razor blades but i can't remember if i have the billy one or the flamingo so I don't know if I need to buy the refills. So I'm just gonna buy a whole new. Okay, we've made our way over to like the dollar aisle aisles now. Um, oh, does this smell good? That does not smell good. I'm looking for some potpourri as well, <laughs> but I think I'm gonna get this little bowl and these little pumpkins. Um, and then I found this pumpkin over here, this pumpkin we have. Okay, we are not done with the targets, but the first trip I would call very successful, but now, I feel like it's time for Bath and Body. Okay, so I just left Target and now we are at the summit or we're pulling into the summit at Birmingham and I am hungry. So I placed an order for just a little cheeseburger from Shake Shack, like no fries or anything. I just need like a little something to hold me over. It's currently 4.50, so it's like a weird, ah, bye. And I decided to place an order for a little cheeseburger at Shake Shack, like I just said. Um, and I think it's almost ready. And then we're gonna go over to Bath and Body Works and get some candles. And I kind of want to just like walk around out here because it just kind of feels good right now. Um, it is in the 80s. Actually, is it? It's, it's 89 degrees in my car, but let me see what it's actually right now. Um, Cause it's really, is it really 85? It does not feel like 85 degrees. Um, Cause it's very like windy out, but yeah. So it's almost five, which is like normally late for me, but Tyler's not going to be back until like midnight. So I'm going to try and keep myself like out and about because I want to be awake when he gets home because I'm probably I get so sleepy so early um, but we're gonna go in here and see if my cheeseburgers are ready and then we're gonna like beep up around here I didn't even wait until I was back in the car to start eating this <laughs> it's so good mm. Mm. I love Shake Shack I remember the first time I had it was in New York City city in one of the parks and it's just so stinking good. Okay, if the quality is different, we are on my phone right now, but got to go to Bath and Body Works. 
And I might pop into Victoria's Secret, honestly, and then Trader Joe's for sure, because I think I'm going to get some pumpkins. And I think they have flowers too, so we might just end up getting them there, but I'm so excited to sniff these candles. Candles have been secured. I got three of them. I'll show you which one we got when we get back in here. But now we're gonna walk over to Trader Joe's and no telling what we're gonna get honestly in here. I feel like I'm gonna end up stocking up on some some food stuff too. I'm in another location now. I left Trader Joe's. My stuff is in the back. I'm trying to be a little bit quicker because I did get their spinach dip and some steaks for me and Tyler. And I don't want them to get too hot. But it's really like not that hot outside. Like it says it's in the 80s. It just maybe it's my mind is telling me it's not. Um, but I went by the Great American Cookie Company because Tyler is like in love with their cookies. He's not like a sweets person, but if he could have one thing in the world that's sweet, it would be these cookies. So I got him a dozen of them to surprise him. And then I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the um, Bath and Body Works candles that I got. Um, they honestly did not have a lot. And I thought it was weird because it's like literally the beginning of September. And they said that this was the last shipment of fall candles that they were gonna get. And I was thinking they just got out there. Um, and they were like, if you don't get them now, you won't get them at all. Oh, this one's messed up. Well, it's not like messed up, but this is messed up. It's the white pumpkin was the first one. And it just smells like clean. It smells like when after you clean your house and it's fall, that's the one I would use. Or like, I don't know, like a Sunday game day, you know, whatever. Um, the next one I got is pumpkin cupcake. It kind of is like vanilla-y. It's very sweet. So this one's like, if you don't like this one, I understand because some people don't like sweet candles. And I only like them for like a little bit of the time. Like I can't have them lit forever, but I do like the general smell of it just being like open. And this one, the most important one, I honestly should have got a few of these leaves. But I think they have leaves during winter time too. I could be wrong about that, but leaves is like top tier my favorite total like 42 dollars i think for these three which is a lot but like some candles out there are like 40 dollars themselves so i didn't feel bad oh i'm about to clean up my car some <laughs> i'm gonna take my shake shack bag um and i got some good stuff in trader joe's i'm gonna do like a full haul when we get home but right now we are outside of the target in homewood which tyler and i came here last night and looked around and they pretty much had like you know all the basic stuff um, but I actually want to come back here because I didn't get to look at their like athletic clothing and they had a bunch of uh, It on sale. I could just see it, but we were kind of like in a hurry So we are back in my normal usual target and I'm trying to figure out like I feel like we need like one or two more pillows so I found this one. It's like not my favorite, but we're running out of options. And then this little guy, I don't think he's a pillow, but I'm gonna cut this little string off and he's gonna become one. And then I got Bella some food. And we are like in desperate need of some new washcloths, so. Me and Tyler always have like a candy bowl out and I think this would be so cute. I'm gonna see how much it is. Okay, we got all all the goods okay guys it is like 7 30 no is it even 7 30 it is 7 34 yes so um i'm back with bella she i got her some treats from trader joe's these little ma maple bacon dog treats and she thought they were the best things ever and then i got her some of her favorite like bougie dog food um so i came and fed her and then put the cold stuff away like the spinach dip and the steaks and then i also got this cookie butter beer um i just got one can from trader joe's and i'm so curious to try it so i put that in the fridge and then i also got this random wine that they had at the front i'm not really a wine drinker and i'm not really like a drinker just to drink like i'd never really like when I'm at home by myself anymore I went through a phase where I was like trying to be cool but let me show you the porch I am it's already dark outside so I'm gonna show you what I can and then we're gonna do like a full haul of everything but I also forgot that I had like $27 in DoorDash credits um so I got some rock and roll sushi um because honestly that little cheeseburger a few hours ago like it did its thing for the moment but now I'm hungry again um I swear since we've started like running and working out I just find myself like so hungry so frequently. I've kind of like got my body used to eating like a little bit every couple of hours. <laughs> like Tyler will be like, you have complained that you were starving for the past several hours and I will eat like, like half a sandwich or something and I'll be full. But like three hours later, I'll be starving again. I can't explain it. I cannot like, 
I don't know. It's very different for me. But anyway, Bella's here. She says hello. Um, we have all of the stuff just like everywhere. But I'm about to eat some of this food. I'm going to sit down. I turn on the Alabama game because Tyler's there right now. War Eagle and go Tar Heels. But I am going to sit down, eat, and then we're going to do our little haul. I missed you so much. I told everyone how lovely you were. I've been missing you. Y'all would honestly think... You, I know you can't really see right now. Bella has turned into like my dog. Don't tell Tyler, but like she is. Oh, she's shaking my hand. She's so precious. Mwah. I love her so much. We may give you a bath tonight, honestly. If we have some free time, ooh, you, cause you could use one, honestly. Also, it's officially time for the haul. Um, I finished my food. I put the rest in the fridge. I went upstairs, put our comforter in the dryer so that it would be nice and dry. Put our sheets on the bed. Um, I'm so ready to get in that bed. I'm ready to take a shower, shave my legs. You know that feeling when you have a clean bed. Um, and then I am now about to give you guys the full haul. I also took Bella on a walk and I heard people screaming and apparently Alabama scored. I have it on the TV just to kind of keep track of when the game's over um, because I want to get everything like set up before Tyler gets here. Um, but I'm going to give you guys like an official haul of everything that we got because I feel like I showed a bunch of stuff. Um, but at the same time, not everything. Okay, first thing I got was two of these pillows. These are from Jungalo. Um, they were, I think, regular 25 on sale for $7.50. And these are honestly, like, cute pillows. Like, if we want to do, like, orange in here or, like, in the bedroom, wherever, like, they're actually, like, super cute. I wish they had more colors. Um, so I got two of those. And then I got this little thing. Um, I just thought it was a cute little thing. I, I guess it's a pillow, but it also has, like, this thing to hang. Probably going to cut that off and just use him as a little cute pillow, a little throw pillow. Um, we always use this stuff on our rug and on our couch. It has, like, a hole in it. I should have got a new one. Um, so I got some of that. I got some of these uh, organic blue corn tortilla chips from Target for my spinach dip, which the spinach dip is in the fridge. If you have not had Trader Joe's, like, the regular schmegular, the cold spinach dip, um, it's so good. It's my favorite, like, pre-made spinach dip, which I really don't need it. I just, I'll eat it throughout the week. I was on the fence about getting this little cauldron thing. It was $10, which, it's like glass, it's good material, and I'll keep it for sure. What I need to do is make sure that I take care of all of this stuff, so that way I can actually use it over the years. But I got this just for our candy bowl. Um, I got these, they were $5 a pack, and me and Tyler just needed some new like uh, washcloths, like very important. Wipes, personal body wipes. And then I got four Alani new. I just really love um, these in the afternoon because I'm about to try and really start stopping, no stop drinking so much Starbucks and coffee. Like when I first, and it's 75 hard, I was fine, cool, whatever. I would get it like once or twice a week or like on the weekends. But now that the pumpkin stuff's out, it's really hard for me. Target, I got a Morphe Continuous Set and Prep Mist. I love this one so much more than the regular one. Um, I didn't realize like how good it was. It was like all they had one day. And I spray it before I do my makeup and like in the middle of my foundation routine and again at the end. I got this pillow also at Target. I'm not like crazy about it. I just felt like we needed another like pumpkin themed pillow. I got this blanket, which I thought was actually really cute. Um, I loved like the dots on it. If you can like, I guess I can just take it out of the package now that we're doing a little haul. I just thought it was really cute. I forgot I got these actually for the kitchen. Little pumpkin and then little figures on the back. Low-key, that could be me and that could be Tyler. And I cannot wait to share, show this to him. Wait, is that Bella? Oh my gosh, is that a dog? That does look like a dog ghost. Oh my goodness, it's literally me, Tyler, and Bella. That's so cute. And then, boring stuff. We needed some more toilet bowl cleaners. Um, I got these wipes. Always have to have these wipes. Some scrub daddies. And then these wipes. And then I got one of these little scrubber things. I'll buy like a new one of these every other week. And then I got some Drano. Well, this is the um, Target brand. It was cheaper and like way more, um, like way more amount. Um, we have like every sink in our house is just clogged. Same for our showers because I like hair, I guess. And then I got two of these beauty sponges. This is from the Con Sonia Kashuk. If you watch my YouTube channel, like in my olden days, back on, um, like when I was in Auburn, I used to like buy her stuff all the time. Um, and then I got the pecan pie liquid soap from Alma Lusa at Portugal. This is what I showed y'all in Target earlier. It smells like almond flavoring, which is like my favorite, one of my favorite scents. It's just, like very sweet. 
oh, it smells so good and then this little buddy was expensive um this is the origins energy boosting gel moisturizer um gel cream with caffeine they kind of changed the name i think but this is like my go-to moisturizer i had like the tiniest bit left so got this okay, i got some dish soap um which we needed and then i got some olay collagen peptide body wash and i really need to start taking care of my teeth more i need to make a dentist appointment um i got this uh whitening uh mouthwash and i got some moisturizing shave gel i think this is the most i've gone shopping since i moved here i got two of these little mini brooms from trader joe's i'm gonna stick like one at the front we have a big one um and then um i'm gonna stick one maybe in the kitchen they just smell so good and then i got these mini pumpkins i may either put these in the cauldron or i also got this little tray which i have yet to see since we got here i found it it's this little tray i I'm gonna maybe put this on the coffee table and use this to hold like the remotes and then also put some pumpkins in there. This is my go-to gum. I chew gum more than anybody you know, I think. I love gum. Um, gum is my favorite candy, if we're being honest. And then I got a new Billy Razor. I got this like purpley, sparkly one. It was cute. And then I got this BB cream. I don't know why anyone, like people don't really talk about this. Um, it is the Dream BB Fresh Cream from Maybelline. I'm in love with this stuff. I've used it for years. This is the light medium shade. Um, again, I don't know why people don't talk about it. Oh, I also got two revives, which are in the fridge. Bella, some nice dog food, which is in the fridge. Oh, let me show you. I got, um, here, we'll go over here. Here in my refrigerator, I got this beer. It is cookie butter beer. It says it's an imperial, imperial, <laughs> it's an imperial golden, let's try this again. It's an imperial golden, file ale oh my gosh okay if y'all saw the font here y'all would be confused too imperial golden ale with toasted coconut vanilla beans and natural flavors and on the back it says it's made with whole vanilla beans milk sugar toasted coconut this full-bodied ale pairs with just about any treat topped with your favorite deliciously unusual cookie butter spread um i think we need to like try this what i'm about to do i'm gonna take this glass and i'm gonna put it in the freezer right there and then we are going to um let that get cold and then we're gonna drink our drink i just filmed so much without actually pressing record but i was sharing with you guys these protein bars right here these are the level one protein bars from first form um i will link them down below if you use my links and shop them that helps me out so much but you don't have to no pressure but i do recommend going and checking these out either way they are they are 20 grams of protein 270 calories and they're so delicious they have so many flavors they just came out with a pumpkin spice flavor these are cookie dough this is my second time ordering these um there's 15 bars in a box and they are just so delicious they're perfect like snack they're honestly like a meal replacement in a way um but i love them and i think you will too i just love anything cookie dough flavored and then i also showed you all of these but i did not press record so let's go again um okay so this formula one pure whey protein isolate this is something i think i talked about it on tiktok before i'm not sure if i fully shared on here but this stuff is so good if you are trying to really focus on protein it's only 100 calories per serving but 20 grams of protein so therefore like say you need three snacks a day you can do this three times a day you know and get 60 grams of protein for only 300 calories which is crazy and we got vanilla milkshake obviously haven't tried it yet um but you can see their older packaging right here there's none left in here like maybe one scoop this is cinnamon toast crunch delicious it's really good with almond milk but you can also use water just reordered this this is my second time ordering the um cinnamon cookie batter and i love their protein powder this is like if you want to shake it in the morning this is like a great like snack option like if you just want to use it your little shaker bottle but if you want to make an actual smoothie for one scoop it's only 150 calories and 24 grams of protein and it is delicious i do like half a banana a small scoop of um frozen strawberries some almond milk and like that's pretty much it you can throw spinach in there chocolate marshmallow just got this flavor i have yet to try it um tyler loves it so i want to see like if i can make other things because we have red velvet which red velvet cake i'm going to be ordering again next round because that one's probably my top favorite and we made red velvet pancakes with it and it was actually delicious but this is the wine that i got it looks a little scary but it said it had like vanilla oh yeah vanilla bean flavors and blueberry black something i cannot read these fonts on here that's why i don't drink wine because i don't like the ones with the cork in it i think i have a thing okay i don't think i have a wine glass so i'm just gonna use this like auburn whiskey cup and i'm just gonna pour a little bit in here go, 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 to try i really hope i like this because i don't like wine normally okay cheers 
It smells <laughs> interesting. Um, whew, it tastes actually, it's like not bad. It tastes like, like Christmas wine. They have this other one that comes out. I cannot remember. It has like a holiday name, like a German name or something. And I got it last year and you like heat it up on the stove and it really does make you feel like you were in a winter wonderland. Um, so it's not like bad. It's just like wine tastes so different than like a fruity little cocktail. Now we can really see what we're working with. And honestly, I don't think it's going to take long at all to like set this up. Cause a lot of this is like actually like my just stuff. Um, and I really want to wash these, but I'm, for the purpose of tonight, when I show Tyler what we got, I'm going to just put these over here. Put these on the stove. It's so cute. Ow. I don't know where to put this little thing. I want one like in the kitchen just because it does smell good. You know, if we have like a trashy smell, which we really take the trash out like every day. So that's not, doesn't really happen. It looks awkward, but we don't really <laughs> use the store that much. Looking better in here. I just have been, you know, tidying up a little, getting our trash cleaned up. Let's get all this stuff. I would have never found that. I'm going to tell Tyler I have a surprise for him in here and he's going to open it and he's going to be so happy. Like, um, I wouldn't call this a first glass because you can see like I barely used any. But first little bit done. We're going to pour a little bit more this time. Kind of the side. I don't know if that's like the best angle. Um, for this coffee table, we have these like big books we normally keep out here. And this wooden thing like doesn't really go. This like wooden bowl. I feel like y'all are so far away. Um, but it's very fall. I'm not like a woody. Like I don't really like... Like, if you looked in here, you wouldn't be able to tell. But, like, if you notice my past apartments, I don't really like, like, textured, like, baskets and, like, wood and, like, earthy stuff. That's not, like, my vibe. I'm a glitz and glam and, like, sleek and modern. This apartment has really, really no theme because we're going to, again, like, get all of our matching furniture once we move. Um, but for now, we're going to try and get, like, a decent thing going. Let's see. Our first candle which is leaves, so excited. Let's see how it goes. Oh my gosh, it smells so good already. I'm gonna do some in here. But we're gonna, I think, drop the rest of them in here for now and then just mix it with candy. I might take away gold pillow and put this in the bedroom and then keep pink pillow because we have the pink, um, what you call it, rug. Maybe we'll do a little ghost over here. We also have Mr. Fall blanket. I know this is just like a cheap little blanket, but like I'm just like not in a place where I want to make myself spend like $40 on a Halloween blanket that I'm going to use for approximately one month out of the year. And this is just too cute. We're going to try the cookie butter beer. And I actually like last year I was really in my beer era and I gained some weight. I've lost it since, but like I get that at the time. I just was drinking beer like every weekend. I think it's because like I hung out with Tyler so much and he loves beer. And it's like I do like some beer, but not a lot of it. And now it's like I don't really have a taste for it. So the glass is nice and cold. The beer is nice and cold. Oh, I need to. Ah. Horrible, horrible pour. Oh my gosh. <laughs> ah, that's so embarrassing. Oh my gosh, y'all. Texas B Alabama. I'm watching it happen right now. 34 to 24, is that what it is? <laughs> Do you just wait on it to go down? Does it go down? That's crazy. I'm so sorry to anyone I offended with this pour. Looks like a delicious like coffee cold foam. That's what I'd rather have, a cookie butter coffee. Okay, do I go? <laughs> this is horrible. Okay, let's try it. Okay. All I got was the foam, but I do, I do taste the cookie butter. I'm going to just try it out of the can. Loki literally tastes like liquid cookie butter, but in beer form. It's actually like not bad. Like I wouldn't drink this all the time just because I don't really like the beer vibe all that much. But this is good. So we just poured another glass of wine. Very baby glasses, as you can tell. Like, I'm probably done after this one. Um, but I went ahead and remembered the powder stuff and decided to go ahead on the carpet just around. And I'm about to let it sit. 
Um, me and Bella are gonna go upstairs. I'll let the comforter and the dryer for the second time because I just know it's not dry. Um, if it is magically, we'll bring it down. It's so cozy in here. It smells so good because of this candle right here. That. Um, I just got out of the shower and I just got, before I got in the shower, I got a phone call from Tyler and his friend that he's with and they asked, do you want to go out tonight in Birmingham? Um, keep in mind, I've had it in my mind all night that me and Tyler are going to like watch a little movie like Halloween Town or Twitches and eat those cookies I got today and maybe finish this bottle of wine and go to sleep because tomorrow um, is Sunday and Tyler actually got us free tickets to a Braves game. So we're going to Atlanta in the morning and the game's at like 1.30 and we wanted to get there early so we could like go to brunch and stuff. Um, <laughs> so I thought we were like getting ready to go to sleep no apparently we are about to go out so it's already after 10 o'clock and tyler is going to be here um probably in like 40 minutes i just checked and they were still in tuscaloosa stuck in a little bit of traffic but um he was about to get on the interstate so i would say he'll be here in like 40 45 minutes so we have decided that we're just gonna rally and go out and i'm really not sleepy because i did before i started vlogging today um i think i mentioned i fell back asleep like i took like a nap from like 11 30 to 12 30 ish it wasn't long and i set my alarm to wake me up for like every 30 minutes um but anyway i have my fourth glass of that wine it somehow tastes better after every bottle but um i really am not going to drink too much tonight because again we are leaving early in the morning and i want to be able to like enjoy my day and not feel bad I'm going to finish my makeup i just love this foundation so much i know you can't really tell the, like the lighting's a little dull in here it's just so pretty and i need to get my actual shade for my skin for like when i'm not wearing self tanner finish my makeup um if i remember i will show tyler's reaction for the cookies when he gets back and maybe i'll vlog i think we're going to finnick if you live in birmingham um which i feel like i'm almost outgrown finnick um you know what i forgot to do i forgot to use my set my prep and setting spray after i talked so much about it today okay all of a sudden i'm really tired 